really quick update on the uh, UCO uh, lamp oil conversion uh, from the candelier to the uh, lamp oil candles that I did with the uh, the little liquor uh, 1.5 ounce liquor bottles. So this has been in storage for uh, almost a year. No, actually about uh, about 10 months it's been in storage and I stored it uh, just just like you see here um, no uh, no caps on the bottles or anything and those are uh, uh, full bottles from last year and then the remaining lamp oil uh, in this little plastic bottle here and I marked it I marked it last year just so I could make sure when I checked from time to time that uh, it wasn't you know the the oil wasn't uh, evaporating out so there's the uh, the candelier I'm gonna go ahead and pop the cap off so we can see the levels on the on the little bottles all right so I got the cap off and you can see that uh, these bottles are still full right where I left them so no uh, no evaporation of the of the oil it uh, seems to be at the same level so I'm gonna go ahead and give them a light and see if they light right off the bat all right so I did check around the uh, tops here and inside just to make sure there wasn't any oil uh, that had leaked so I'm gonna go ahead and uh, get these wicks lit and see uh, if you can store it just uh, with full bottles and then just light it when you need it these have not been lit in almost a year there you have it So that's pretty cool. Again, I'm not using this in the truck camper. I'm just, I'm using it in here just for a little uh, additional heat, uh, like while I'm sitting around on the computer or whatever. And uh, this stuff burns for about 10 hours and uh, puts off some pretty good heat. You know, it's just like one of those little personal heaters. It's not gonna heat a room, but uh, it, uh, Keeps you comfortable while you're sitting at your computer, sipping a cup of coffee or whatever. So, um, still digging it. That uh, that uh, UCO candelier is uh, is pretty cool. So I'm gonna break this thing out and keep using it for the rest of the winter here while I'm uh, you know doing computer stuff in the morning. And these uh, UCO lanterns are still. Uh, this is the candelier deluxe. It was the the three uh, wax candle version. And of course I did the, the four burner uh, conversion with the uh, lamp oil. So they're still available uh, for under $50. Uh, you can still find them online. And I still recommend it. It's a great lantern and uh, just puts out really nice heat. And um, you know, like, like I can't really put my hand any, any closer than that without it getting too hot. So. Uh, it's really nice, comfortable heat, puts out a nice light in the evening, and um, you know it's, it's just really good personal heat. Again, I don't recommend it for heating a larger area or really in, a, in an RV like I had tested last year. It's just not very practical, um, and it, it is inexpensive, and if you've got a, you know, a smaller space, it might work for you, but uh, there are, are better options out there. So anyway, they are available. I do still recommend it. It's a it's a nice uh, nice addition to um, you know a, a larger heater or something like that for a, for a bigger room. Uh, you can keep this by your side and it keeps you nice and toasty and it ha adds a, a nice light. And the uh, you know the burn time is around ten hours, so it's really economical. This lamp oil is really inexpensive to purchase, and um, out of that one little bottle. From last year, I've probably had maybe 60 to 80 hours of burn. So, and that that bottle was, you know, ten dollars or less. So, pretty economical. All right, so I'll get back to the truck camper videos uh, later, a little bit later this week. Um, got uh, a couple of uh, maintenance videos as far as the uh, furnace and the safety systems. 
and uh, propane and appliances and things like that. So stay tuned for those. If you haven't subscribed, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and uh, we'll see you on the next video. Later.